But I mean, but but the thing is, I can't get my robe sewn but from Christmas. But the thing is, but everybody always wants something. See, 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 but see, mom see. can't get nothing. Oh mom, I vacuumed your room. Oh mom, I cleaned your bathroom. Oh mom, I did this. Oh mom, I made dinner. Oh mom, on a consistent basis. But oh mom, I did this. Oh mom, I had an extra ten dollars. I put gas in your car. Oh mom, this. Oh mom, that. What's up, Bass Babes? It's your girl Joy back with another banger. Oh, I just ran up the stairs, child. Before I get into this video, I'm sorry. Give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Oh my gosh. I did some serious running, okay? But why are all the girls in my closet? They're in my closet, the one where they say mom doesn't have any swag or no flavor, but they in my stuff. Look at this. Sydney. And look at Sydney. Sydney's in my closet. She's, what are you doing, Sydney? What you doing, Sydney? I'm volunteering at a gala. So, and the theme is animal print. So we have to wear something animal print. So the story behind this dress, y'all know I was married a couple of times, right? <laughs> so, I don't know if we were engaged, not their dad. I didn't have children with my first husband, okay? I didn't have, we didn't have kids together. He's such an amazing, amazing, amazing guy. I just think it was the wrong timing for us. We didn't see the diamond in the rough that we both had on each other. That's what it was. Um, really nice guy. So anyway, he's, I think we were dating. I'm not sure if we were engaged or dating. And he, and we were out in the village in New York and I saw this dress and I fell in love with it. He was in law school at the time. Yeah, he was in law school. And I fell in love with this dress, this gown dress. It's a wrap dress. Looks quite good on Sydney. There was a hat, a huge hat to go with the dress. Oh my gosh, and he surprised me. I don't know if it was my birthday or just, just because. And he surprised me with the dress. And I was so excited. And then he pulled out the hat. The hat was a big hat that matched the same pattern as this dress. Honey, we went to a wedding. I don't know, I'm, I'm not gonna say I stole the show, but Hunsy, that hat was big. I was in heaven. It was it was just awesome. So she's doing something volunteer stuff and they have to wear. So I said, well, I have this dress, but now she's saying it's making her feel claustrophobic. I think that is absolutely perfect, especially for the theme and glitch. Yeah, for the theme. Where does this go? You looked good in it. Bobby's up in my closet, and a lot of my clothes they're really too big for me. <laughs> um. I'm probably the smallest in the house. And these pants, I love, love, love these pants, but they're really too big, but I wear them anyway. I haven't worn them in a long time. So Bobby, and they fit her length. They're big right here, so That's because you're you're gathering it too tight, Bobby. But if I don't gather, it's gonna fall off of me. And I don't like how low they fit. Oh, see, I wear I like my, my stuff my, low. I like my stuff high. But what do I wear with this? A blazer. So find a black blazer to go with it in my closet. So Bobby, you're gonna have to tell why what's going on with you. Which one? Any black blazer. I have like 50 black blazers. But it's like they're going shopping in my closet, y'all. Could you have the professional clothes? This one? Oh yeah, that's a good one. That's a wrap blazer. It's a what? It's, it wraps around your waist, so therefore you maybe not wear. What do you mean? It has a drawstring, it has a string. Oh, there's my pockets. <laughs> right, it just, it's, oh. I mean, this is one type of blazer, and it's just, um, you button it right there, and you just wrap it around. This is just one blazer, but of course you wouldn't have this, or you can open it like that, and it flips down, Bobby. You can have it open, or you can have it oh. pinned. You wouldn't wear the bow. That's a bit. cool blazer. Yeah. Wait, can I turn? 
Whoa, it's so dressy. <laughs> Um, no, it's like, it's like, it's different. It's like, what? I don't. Sorry, mom, where do I put this? So that's a no for you. I'm not sure yet. Okay, let me see another one. So option one. Wait, I like. <gasps> mom, I want to dress like that. <laughs> hey guys, I have so many dressy clothes. I, it's just like I, I don't feel it anymore. I just don't feel it today. I had this on. Did I have on a blazer today? Oh, a vest. I had this on with a vest, child. Guys, they all up in my closet. So this is what I had on today, and my earrings, and I had on a sparkly belt. I took the belt off, y'all. So this is what I had on with my little um, red chucks, <laughs> and that's what. That's how I was feeling today. So I, I just more now comfy. I guess I'm just more comfy and, woo. But I'm a blazer, a t-shirt, or a sweater and slacks and chucks. I guess I do have a stuff. So that's it for my dressy stuff. Mm -hmm. I, I, the spirit has to hit me. Okay, what's going on now? I'm trying on a different one. Oh, a different blazer. Yeah. Okay. But then I have about seven blazers and a cleaners. Okay. That looks good too. Which one do you like? That I think I like that one better. I like this one better. Really? Mm hmm You like the other one better? So can y'all see that? But I don't know. Show them Bobby. <laughs> I don't know. But you do think I should wear a blazer? Absolutely. Look, all right, so now you have to tell them what you're going for, Bobby. Um, okay, so I got nominated to be a part of, I'm gonna try on those pants next. Okay. I got nominated to be a part of this thing called Girl State, which is basically just me and a few other girls throughout my school got invited and it's basically kind of like a government type seminar where I'll go to Austin for a week over the summer and we kind of learn about the government and everything it's kind of a big deal it looks good really good on like my college applications and so I basically got nominated but now I have to interview to get one of the spots and we have to dress business casual so I have to figure out what I'm gonna wear and that is why I'm in my mother's closet because I don't have clothes like this but okay and so what else were you nominated for today Bobby oh so today Bobby called me with some good news at school and I put her on speaker in my classroom okay Bobby go um I also got nominated for i mean not nominated chosen to be a part of national honor society which has been my biggest goal my biggest goal in high school is to be a part of national honor society so how do you how how do you get into the national honor society i have no idea to be honest i think it has something to do with grades and i have no idea no idea okay I'm gonna try on these pants next. Yeah, somebody else took these off the hanger. You, you, you tried. I think I tried those on uh, when I was um, looking for something to work my ankle. See, I know how my stuff is. <laughs> Cause and I was somebody those, keeps coming in my room. I was, oh, I was trying on those green pants, so those are probably on the hanger wrong. She don't know nothing about the crease going down the middle of the slack, okay? That's the thing. That, that it's aging myself is what that's doing because it's saying I'm a certain age because back in the day, we had a crease down the center of our pants and we used starch. What? Starch? You don't know what starch is? <laughs> you don't know what starch is, Bobby? No. Now, Bobby. What is starch? <laughs> what is guys she wants to know what starch is any of you young ones out there know what starch is <laughs> you put starch in your clothes that stiff 
and crispy. Crispy. Like, what kind of starch? Is that like a product? It's a spray. It's a mm. spray that you spray on your clothes before you iron them. So then they're like, iron. Yes. And lots of men get their shirts starched and creased. You see? They all up in my stuff, boo. But no. Mom's not cool. Mom has no swag. But who up in my stuff? Okay? Because you know stuff, it goes full circle. It goes out of style, it comes back in style. It's not that I have a lot of stuff, it's just that the stuff I have, I've just had a very long time. And that's why I buy my clothes big, so even if I gain a few pounds, I can still fit my clothes. You looking nice, Bobby. You go, Bobby. Ooh, they not gonna know who you are, girlfriend. Yes. Yes. <laughs> So this the one? Yes, that's the one, Bobby. I have to change Or you don't have to have it in front. You can just, I tried to put it on. Or you can do like this, sorry y'all. Or you can do like that and have it on the side so it's not in the way, like that. Doesn't have to be in the front. <laughs> I, I like that tie, what is that? Tricks in the trade, boo. Something. Yes, I do. <laughs> Look how tall she is to me, guys. Can y'all see that? Oh. <laughs> I don't remember how to do it. Stop, stop, stop. I look like a businesswoman? Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Wait, is that for team leadership? I'm telling you now. No, still not there. Is that for team leadership? Look how tall they are, guys. No. Clinton, how tall are you? 6'5. Six, You're 6'5? Six, yeah. 6'5, like 6'6. Six, six, six. I see you 6'5. So, how tall are you next to Clinton? Well, I got my shoes on, but I'm probably. You're probably like 6'3. Six, six, like six two. This one, this is how tall. Because I still have a couple like inches. You go in like that. Uh uh. I'm tired. On a dance. Why do you keep coming in my room? Huh? Huh? Why do you keep coming in my room? Because I like the way in here. I haven't felt good for like the past three days. So then I you put I your germs corona, around. I think I had the coronavirus. So right, so you spread your trap. <laughs> I'll be putting locks on my door. I think I have coronavirus. I'm gonna do can you take a picture of me? I don't know who you don't mean. Let me make it to the weekend so I can put my lock on my door. This is the face. This is the face that you do that we always have. That's the face. That is the face, mom. This is the face. And you start with this. <laughs> This bit, you start with this face, you, and then like, you see it coming, and then it's, it's this face. Yeah, <laughs> yes, yes, it's that. I do it in the classroom too. I'm like, and they probably like, oh, I'm, 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 she, she doing the face. She doing the face. <laughs> She gonna ask Bobby. She knows what I'm gonna ask. Money? No. Take you somewhere? It's just time. I'm not redoing no hair. We could do a front row. Spring break? We just did those braids. Like, you need a job so you can start paying somebody to do your hair. I can pay you. I need twenty dollars. But it's like, let me just lay it out for you like this, mom. So, on average, let's say, people spend about 200 
to $300 getting their hair done. Yes, they do. Yes, right. they do. And so, they spend, let's just go $250. But, I, but, but the thing is, I can't get my robe sewn but, from Christmas. But the thing is, but everybody always wants something. See, 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 but see, mom see. can't get nothing. Oh, mom, I vacuumed your room. Oh, mom, I cleaned your bathroom. Oh, mom, I did this. Oh, mom, I made dinner. Oh, mom, on a consistent basis. But, oh, mom, I did this. Oh, mom, I had an extra $10. I put gas in your car. Oh, mom, this. Oh, mom, that. Oh, mom, you need me to wash your clothes that's been sitting there for about three weeks or something like that? Ma, you want me to polish your toenails? Ma, you want me to scrub the skin off your feet because it's starting to build up down on the bottom like that because now you're neglecting yourself. That's what you're doing. Um, but take it like this, y'all. Let me get back to what I was saying. So, let's just say people spend about $200 to $300 getting their hair done. So, let's just average that out to a good $250. And I would say the amount of times I get my hair done a year by this beautiful lady right here, I would say, how many times? Five, six times a year, five times a year? Multiply that by 17 years. So, how much you owe me? No, 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 no. We're just talking about right now. Okay, so oh, uh, how oh. many times a year do you think I get my hair done? Five, six times a year? Because, you know, 12 months in a year, I probably wear this for two months. Okay, so we'll just say, we'll just say five times a year. Six times a year, six times a year. So I, she braids my hair, let's just say six times a year. And so just by her braiding my hair, she saves a whopping... One thousand five hundred dollars. Oh, it's what I'm saving. It's what I'm saving. <laughs> on average, she saves fifteen hundred dollars just by her doing my hair, bro. So is she saving all this money by doing my hair? And if she sent me to someone, that is fifteen hundred dollars plus. Plus, I thought she was gonna done. say. This is what I owe you, mom. And that's what I thought she was gonna say, not say what I was saving. And put this on record. I can you believe that boy? Be up no, we're not talking about that. I, I am going to work my hardest to be a successful woman in the future, just so I can pay back this woman right here for doing my hair through my. Oh, so you want to pay me back for doing your hair? And not, not just that. Oh, not, not, so not, not, I'm just not the stylist around here. Not just, Nothing. not just my hair, but you know the roof over my head, the food, the love that she gives me every single day for for everything, for everything, mom. So put me on record right here. I will, I'll repay you one day, mom. One day when I. And making coin. Coin. Knock on it. I believe you'll be very successful, Bobby, because you have a phenomenal work ethic. Mm hmm So that is what I'm proposing. Spring break. This is why I don't enjoy spring break. I don't enjoy breaks. Because the break is never mine. Is the... Where's my passport? Let me put the lock on my... So, we're putting this on record here. She's going to do my hair this right Okay. Alright, and this is it for tomorrow. Alright, it looks good. It's good, Bobby. My feet are already hurting. <laughs> Oh, I had to take this hair down. It's like when I wear it up in that top bun, it itches right up in here. It's, I lost the braid, guys. Came right out. <laughs> um, I said I wasn't going to be talking about this, but it, I'm not going to talk about it because I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. I just need to put the lock on my door. I just need to put the lock on. I'm too tired right now. Um, had to go to a play with Sydney after work. It's nine o'clock now. Had to go to a play. So I rushed home, stuck in traffic for about, so I drove for about two hours straight. 
stuck in traffic, had to attend a play with Sydney. She did it for a school project. And um, so might as well attend the play with her because I would have to drop her off, pick her up. So might as well just watch it. Well, it was a pretty good play. The acting was phenomenal. So they came home and everybody bombarded my closet. That's how that, that's how that went. I'm trying not to say nothing. I'm putting a lock on tomorrow. I'm gonna wait till this weekend because then I, I need to relax and think about it. Okay? Let me think about it. <laughs> I can't be in the attitude. So right now I, I can't, I can't, I can't, I, I, okay. So Connie Chow sent me a lock for my, for my dough. And she sent me batteries for the smoke detector. I am going to do it this weekend. In my head, that's what I'm going to do y'all. In my head, I'm going to get it done. Yes, I am. <laughs> but that irritates me. I don't want to hear it. I just don't. I don't want to hear it. <sighs> I'm, I'm just going to keep my mouth shut. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> Give this video a thumbs up. Like, comment, share, subscribe. It's gonna be a great day tomorrow because the, as of this video, tomorrow is Friday. So, but I'm, I'm, my videos are backed up now, y'all. Nothing exciting. All five of y'all, just, just tune in and watch them. All five of y'all can watch them, okay? Maybe I go live this weekend. Oh, yeah. There's stuff to do this weekend. Bobby was invited to attend a basketball game for five dollars. So I think it's college, college basketball, but she still hasn't answered whether or not she wants to go, and that's Saturday. So I don't know. All right, guys, I'm getting ready. Get comfortable, pray, edit, try to, my best to get through a video. I fell asleep during the play. <laughs> I'm tired, y'all. I'm tired. And I know when I'm tired, but I get little serious bags up under these little eyes, child. All right. Hopefully I get some rest. That's why I, I'm really not looking forward to spring break. It, it's not relaxing for me. It's not a break for me at all. It, it, it's not a break. Ooh. Two more. Ooh. Don't get me started on that passport, y'all. Y'all think I'm playing? Baby. Baby. Oh, another thing I'm doing this weekend, I'm loading up my car for the second time and I'm taking stuff to the Goodwill. I did, um, I dropped off a huge load last weekend. My garage is a mess. I'm telling y'all, I'm purging. I'm purging. I, I, I want it gone. Gone. So, um, I'll go into my garage. Maybe you guys can help me purge. Um, this weekend, maybe I'll take you to the scary garage I don't even want to talk about the garage dough. I don't even want to talk about that. Because I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> I don't want to hear it. So anyway, now I need to call these people to see if they can bring someone out to fix my garage dough. Because now it doesn't go up with... All right. So... All right, I have a nice night. I have a nice night. I may need a margarita this weekend. <laughs> Nerves are bad with these kids, child. Even the thought of spring break now is making my nerves bad. <sighs> All right, y'all, let me stop playing with y'all. I'll try to go live um, this weekend. All right. Give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, share, and subscribe.